two history, two coaches that know each other very well in a rivalry that has gotten very fun. Daniel Gutierrez, our head official. Joey Zawatowski, his assistant as well as Katarina Wasi. But what I was saying, when you have that influx of talent. As Stroud comes forward, no rest for the weary here. Etienne Jr. with the shot, and he clips it over the his line there. And as soon as that ball got laid back, at I think as Brian White comes forward here, Etienne Jr., a chance on goal. He puts it by McGuire and rolls it in. The dab got himself, Derek Etienne Jr., and his second appearance. And he definitely does that here. You see the ball in, Tanari just kind of helps it on to Brian White. And then it's that run that I said that Moreno always likes to make from in between the outside back and the center back and a perfectly weighted ball from Brian White. Daniel Gutierrez whistle blows as we enter. The minimum of one minute of stoppage time that we've hit. Could be the last chance here of this first half. Coming forward and put it to the back of the net. Anthony Fontana in what is the last kick of the first half. Yeah, and just early, you see here the ball from Moore. A fantastic run, splitting those two in Stroud. Path of Amando Moreno, it pulls him a little wide. Moreno now cutting in. He takes the left-footed shot, and it's pushed just wide by McGuire. The whole play with that clearance from Escobar to him. He holds the ball up. Right now, the equalizer for Bethlehem Steel. Lemma coming forward. Goes wide for Moreno. Moreno with the shot, and he beats McGuire. Armando Moreno's ninth of the year. He leads Red Bulls two in goals, and he's leading them right now to victory. He hit those first two chances with his left. We had the shot earlier that went off White's face with his right that he got a hold of in here. He just takes those two little more honestly and not allow that little half yard that he was able to get that shot off with his right foot and a fantastic goal. Barlow showing that speed a little bit. He gets a chance on goal with a deflection, so it'll go out for a corner kick, which may be the end of this one. So we've got those two blasts of a whistle. New York Red Bulls, too, get a 2-1 win here over Bethlehem Steel. Hunter, it wasn't easy. May not have been the prettiest game, but for New York Red Bulls, too, showing a different side of themselves, continuing to prod and poke and get that.